I mean, as you can see here, like with a traditional uh, chronograph, like, you know, we kind of take it for granted, but those are very small numbers, very small hands. Yeah. It's just the standard way of doing it, so you're used to it. But if you're going to look at this at a glance, maybe you're in a vehicle racing around a track and there's, I don't know, bumps. There's probably not bumps, but you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> it's vibrating from yeah. a motor. Yeah. Like, it's not going to be easy to read. Whereas this one uh, would be easy to read at a glance, um, making that even more, you know, easy those the hour minute hand which granted are stacked right now mm -hmm. jump into place so they're not crawling so you know if it's pointing the minute hands pointing at five it's been five minutes plus whatever seconds and hour, you know yeah. so on and so forth so it's really great at a glance and like if you've ever used a lamani 5100 watch or something like that with a central minute hand like it's it is a nicer way of reading a chronograph yeah 